now let us discuss about one bit sliding window protocol the name itself specifies the meaning one bit that means the sender window size as well as the receiver window size is one that means at a time sender can sense only one frame to the receiver and receiver can also receives only one frame from the sender uh, let's see what is one bit sliding window protocol so first the sender can sense one frame to the receiver and then sender will waits for the acknowledgement from the receiver only after receiving the acknowledgement from the receiver then only it can send another frame to the receiver so sender sends a frame to the receiver after that receiver provides acknowledgement to the sender after receiving the acknowledgement sender can send second frame to the receiver so likewise the process will continue so we can say that one bit sliding window protocol is similar to stop and wait protocol why because in stop and wait protocol also at a time sender can send only one frame and receiver can receives only one frame so sender sends a frame to the receiver receiver receives the frame and provides acknowledgement to the sender and after that sender can sends another frame uh, then receiver receives the frame and provides the acknowledgement to the sender so we can say that one bit sliding window protocol as well as stop and wait protocol both are same only whereas if the window size is 2 bits 3 bits 4 bits 5 bits then both are different so sliding window protocol and stop and wait both are different but if but here one bit sliding window protocol as well as stop and wait both are same only okay uh, let us discuss about uh, one bit sliding window protocol with the help of uh, these two figures these two diagrams uh, let us see the first diagram uh, here uh, we know that uh, every frame uh, is represented with the help of a sequence number uh, here let us assume that uh, uh, sequence number size is 3 bits sequence number contains 3 bits so totally we can store 2 power 3 frames now why because here the sequence number size is 3 bits so totally we can store 2 power uh, 3 sequence numbers 2 power 3 means 8 sequence numbers so totally we can store 8 frames from frame 0 to frame 7 if you observe here this is frame 0 frame 1 the sequence number represents frame 2 the sequence number represents frame 3 likewise frame 4 frame 5 frame 6 frame 7 so every frame must have a sequence number okay uh, here uh, this is the first stage so this is a this column represents a so this is sender state and this is receiver state this column represents b this is sender state and this is receiver state so initially the sender has no frame to send so that's why that is represented with the help of this vertical line this vertical line specifies that sender has no frame to send to the receiver okay whereas if you see here the vertical line is represented like this so sender is expecting sender is waiting for first frame whereas here sender is waiting for zeroth frame zeroth frame whereas if you if you observe the receiver at a time receiver can uh, receive one uh, frame from the sender so receiver is expecting frame number 0 from the sender so that's why it is represented like this so this portion represents frame 0 so receiver is expecting frame 0 from the sender so this is a now let us see the b state sender has sent frame 0 to the receiver so that's why it is represented like this this state represents frame 0 so sender transmits frame 0 to the receiver but it will takes some time for the receiver to receives that frame so that's why here receiver receiver is waiting frame number 0 from the sender so receiver doesn't receive the frame number 0 it is still expecting frame 0 from the sender so that's why here we have an arc like this so this is frame 0 now let us see the c state so this represents c this represents d okay so sender sent frame number 0 and receiver receives frame number 0 so here the receiver receives frame number 
so that's why it is waiting for frame number one from the sender so that's why here we have an arc like this this arc represents frame number one receiver receives frame zero and it is waiting for frame number one from the sender okay now let's see the next one let's see the next one so now sender knows that that uh, frame is successfully submitted to the receiver so it is waiting for the first frame it is waiting for the first frame it is waiting for the first frame so still it doesn't receive the first frame it is waiting for the first frame okay next here here receiver is waiting for first frame from the sender so what is the last diagram receiver is waiting for the first frame from the sender as well as sender is also waiting for the first frame if it receives the first frame from the network layer then that frame will be transmitted to the corresponding uh, receiver okay the frame will be transmitted to the corresponding receiver so this is the first diagram now let us see the second diagram how the data will be transmitted from source to the destination uh, so here a b we have two missions a and b a represents source b represents destination a sends uh, here if we observe this notation this notation has three arguments the first argument represents sequence number second argument represents acknowledgement number third argument represents packet number third argument represents packet number so here a is sending frame number 0 so 0 is nothing but frame 0 sequence number so this one is nothing but acknowledgement let us assume that previously a has received frame number 1 acknowledgement from the receiver okay so this one represents acknowledgement number assumes that previously host a has received frame number 1 acknowledgement from the receiver so that's why here we have 1 comma what is the next one packet number packet number is nothing but combination of host as well as sequence number here the host is a a sequence number is 0 so a 0 so sender sends this frame to the receiver sender sends this frame to the receiver so now host b gets 0 comma 1 comma a naught so host b gets 0 comma 1 comma a naught okay next next here b has received the frame from the receiver so now it has to provide acknowledgement to the sender acknowledgement to the sender so that's why it is sending one more packet one more frame so b sends here we have in addition to the acknowledgement here we can also send the sequence number also here what is the notation sequence number comma acknowledgement comma packet in addition to the acknowledgement it can also sense its own packet its own frame so b sends so it is sending its own frame host b is sending its own frame that frame sequence number is 0 and what is this 0 this 0 is nothing but acknowledgement to the sender previously a has sent sequence number 0 so this second 0 specifies that it is the acknowledgement for the source okay comma and this is the packet number we know that packet is represented with the help of host as well as sequence number here the host is b as well as sequence number is 0 b sends 0 comma 0 comma b naught so now a receives that message a gets 0 comma 0 comma b naught so by observing this acknowledgement number by observing this acknowledgement number here the second argument is acknowledge number so a came to know that sequence number 0 that is frame number 0 is correctly arrived to the sender correctly arrived to the receiver now a can send se uh, first frame to the receiver so previously a has sent zeroth frame frame number 0 now a can send first frame to the receiver so a sends so this one represents frame number one sequence number comma previously a received acknowledgement for frame number zero sequence number previously a received frame number zero acknowledgement so this zero represents that acknowledgement number comma packet number a and what is the sequence number a1 so a sends this message to the receiver so like so let's see let's see this diagram so so here b sends uh, yeah here a sends one comma a sends one comma zero comma a naught okay 
A sense 1 comma 0 comma A naught. So 1 means frame number 1 sequence number, this 0 means previous frame acknowledgement number as well as A1. Now B gets 1 comma 0 comma A naught. B gets 1 comma 0 comma A naught. Now B has to send acknowledgement for the first two frame. So B sends, so this one specifies that B is sending its own frame. That frame sequence number is 1. In addition to the sequence number, B can also provides acknowledgement also. Acknowledgement for the previous frame. So what is the previous frame 1? What is the previous frame sequence number 1? So that one is provided here. This is nothing but acknowledgement. Next, packet number. So B is the host, 1 is the sequence number, B1. Now, now, now A gets 1 comma 1 comma B1. So likewise the transmission will be happen from sender to receiver. So this is about 1 bit sliding window protocol. 